How's it guys? Welcome back to Extreme Makeover, Home Workout Edition. We hope you are ready for a tough week of training because we've got a lot in store for you this week. Monique will explain the skill and accessory which would also act as your warm-up. And then after that, Mark will explain your workout. Your warm-up for tomorrow, which is also your skill and accessory work, is going to be a 12 minute demon, which means every minute on the minute you'll be doing a certain amount of work. In your first minute, you're going to be doing 30 seconds of double unders, or if you do not have double unders yet, or you're still um, learning the skill, you're going to do double under practice. So if you can do a few doubles, you're going to do a single, single, double, single, single, double, okay? Otherwise, if you do not have doubles at all, you are going to do um, regular single unders, but jumping high, okay? Remember, you want to stay in the um, ball of your feet, okay? And you want to try and not bend your legs too much. Keep those legs straight. And then if you do not have a skipping rope, you can just do jumping jacks. Minute two, you're going to do eight dumbbell or barbell seated Z presses. And you're going to go straight into four pie cans and push-ups after that, okay? So, the barbell Z press, I'll demonstrate with a, a dumbbell for you first. You're going to be seated, legs straight up in front of you, sitting nice and tall. You are you holding the dumbbell like this, okay? From here, I'm going to press straight up and back down. Okay. You're doing eight of those. If you have a barbell, use a barbell. Okay, so from here. And then after that, you're going to go into four pike handstand push-ups. Okay. So most of my weight is going to be shifted onto my arms from here, down, and up. And that's your warm-up and skill work for tomorrow. Alright guys, so your workout for tomorrow is a long workout. Alright, we've got three movements and we've got a descending ladder of reps. Okay, so your three movements will be front squats with a barbell, if you have a barbell. So, this is going to act as my barbell. I'll, be, I'll clean the bar up and you'll start your front squat from here. All right. You are going to do 60 kilograms for the guys and 35 for the girls. Okay. So front squat. That's how it looks. All right. Then you've got bar facing burpees. So you will then put your barbell on the floor and you're going to do your burpees. Over the ball, around. Then that'll be followed by strict handstand push-ups, and I'll explain at the end of the um, workout demonstration what you're going to do if you can't do strict handstand push-ups. Okay. So your your rep range will be 21, 15, 9, 6, 3 of those three movements that I just explained. Then, if you do not have a bar, you're going to do goblet squats, but instead of 21 reps of the Squats, you are going to do double the reps. So you'll be doing 42, 30, 18, 12, and 6. All right, so I'm going to demonstrate with my dumbbell. Okay, so I want you guys to grab the heaviest dumbbell or kettlebell you can, and then you will be doing goblet squats like that, or you can do with a dumbbell, you can also do them like that. Okay, and then with your kettlebell. Over there. Alright. Guys, make sure that your elbows are nice and high and they're not against your body because if you squat down and your elbows touch your knees, it could be possibly it could be dangerous, it's definitely dangerous, but it can possibly hurt your wrist with an impact going down into your wrist. Okay, so that is double the reps, so 42, 30, blah blah blah. And then you'll be also doing over the um, dumbbell burpees. So you'll face the burpee over the dumbbell, do your burpee, jump over, turn around and continue. And you will also be doing strict handstand push-ups. Okay, remember the burpees and the strict handstand push-ups will be 21, 59, 63. Okay, 
Then, if you do not have any equipment, you will be doing A squats. So you're doing three times the reps of the front squats. It's 64 front uh, A squats in your first set. Okay. So your rep, 63. Sorry, your rep range is 63, 45, 27, 18, 9. Okay. Just a regular A squat. And then you'll be doing 21, 15, 9, 6, 3 of over the object, burpee. So you can put down anything that you want to jump over, okay? Make sure it's not too high, or even it can just be a line on the floor, all right? So if you have a line, or draw a imaginary line, make sure that you jump with both feet and land with both feet at the other end of your line or over your object, okay? Now, how do we scale the strict handstand push-up? Your, your options are feet up, pike handstand push-ups. So you're gonna use a platform that's higher than your feet, a chair, a couch, anything that you can put your feet higher, and you can do your pike handstand push-up, all right? Pike handstand push-up, uh, just imagine that I have something, my feet on something, all right? It's basically a handstand push-up, keep your bum nice and high, and do a shoulder press, okay? The next step, if you can't do those, or if it's too much for you, you're going to do regular pike handstand push-ups, like I just showed you. If you can't do them, your shoulders are really buggered from all the work, then you're going to do hand release push-ups. Okay, a hand release push-up. Put down, hands off, and press. Okay. Um, guys, I'm, you're going to get tired in this workout. I don't want you to do a burpee push-up. Alright, so none of this. Okay. I want you guys to do strict push-ups. So knees stay off the floor. Knees and hips stay off the floor as much as you can. Alright, so yeah, it's a 25 minute time cap. And then your movement prep will be... I want you guys to warm up your front squats and your goblet squats to your weight that you're going to use in the workout. I want you to do a couple of burpees and then also warm up your version of the strict handstand push-up that you're going to do. Remember, Oryx is strict handstand push-up, then you've got feet elevated handstand push-up, normal pike handstand push-up, and hand release push-ups. I don't want you guys to be keeping today. Alright. Enjoy, guys.